everybody. I've got my fabric. I said that I would do a video tutorial on how to do this. Um, so I've got my fabric here, um, and I've got what I've done is I've doubled it up because it's one huge piece, and I've just doubled it up here and made a little hole down here on the bottom and kind of brought one end up a little bit. And then what I found happened with my first session is a little newborn's head fell over because this part hung down as much as this part here did. So for the next session, I made sure that I pulled the front part up just a little bit so that it hangs a little bit higher than this part here. I'm going to just pull it over the branch like this. Okay. And when I pulled it there, I actually took the two pieces and separated them in the back. As you can see back here, I separated the two pieces in the back. And I brought this up a little bit because the baby, when it hangs, it's going to pull. So, I brought this side around the front, and then I went around the opposite way and brought this one around this way. So you have that cute little thing about there. And then I'm going to turn the wood around so you can see. Oh, I've got balloons hung on there from a session that I did. So from the back, you see it's not here. And I tied it like in a gazillion. So I'm going to wrangle this thing here. I held it between my legs. And I took this back here and tied this in a knot. And I really, really pull on it. Because when I put a baby in here, I do not want that baby to fall. And even with it tied like this, the baby's not going to fall. But when you look at it from this angle, this hanging down does not look very attractive. As you can see, it just kind of flops. So, what I did was come back here and I tied another knot. I made this one a little bit looser and just kind of crammed the edges in so that it wouldn't see it. You couldn't see it from the front side. So you see on the back side, it's not very pretty. Um, but you've got some hanging here, which is plenty, I think. Hmm. Like I'm an expert, I've only been able to do this twice. Um, but I will go ahead and put it on the branch first. And then I'll just take the baby. And either I, if I've got the baby, then I'll have mom hold it open like this. So you can see through it. And then I'll just slide the baby in this way. Imagine this is baby's head. Try to bring the fabric where the opening is kind of like that. Of course, it would be the other way because we wouldn't want this ugly knot to be in there. Um, and then when you put the baby in there, you stretch this over the edge of its head. And this will come around its neck. But you take a hand and try to put the hand there so the baby doesn't choke. So, at the end, you have this little knot. And if it's not exactly what you want, you could just kind of put it in there you have it. And then for the other, way I did the knot was I had the back end like this and I just brought it around and from the back side like here from the back side I took one of these and pushed it through the top up here Pulled it through like that, and then from this one coming around, I just tied the knot here. Tied really tight. 
And then also do the pull check to see if it, it is going to stay. So, there you have it. And then you can just tuck this in wherever you can find the spot to tuck it so that it doesn't show on the other side. And then you have a different cover on. So, that's how I did it. Hope you enjoyed it.